So you guys remember how we access our marketing? And uh, we're gonna go to rogfuturecenter.com. That is our main page that hasn't changed. You guys can just go there and find all the things I'm gonna be talking about today. Uh, I'm gonna start. Can you repeat? Easy. Okay, can oh. you repeat? Sorry, yeah, I, for I, sure. I, I... Uh, hold me on. So it's going to be rogfuturecenter.com. It's the same place you guys have been placing your orders right now. Okay. So I'm going to put it in the chat right now for everyone, just in case. Rogfuturecenter. Oops. Center. Futures with S. Yeah, future, like our company name, center.com. It is in the chat. You guys can check it out there. Um, I'm just gonna move this out of my way. So this is our website. We already all have diving into this one before. Uh, I'm gonna start with the office assets, some things that change in there, and then we're gonna move over to the other things. So first things first, if remember how we used to um, save our uh, the conference room reserve here on in Castro Valley, that was one of the first things we changed. Now we have these Brand new calendar is gonna be really easy to use. So we're gonna come to office assets, refers conference room, and then in everything, I made sure I put a little step-by-step -step in the bottom so you guys can check it out. And we're gonna click on reserve. In my case, since I have signed in before, I'm coming right away to the reservation area if you guys see all my um information is auto populated so you guys don't have to worry about typing again and i can select the location in my case in this case i'm going to select san ramon and i can choose for example the conference room the date right and then i can select the time slot all right let's do this um i'm going to select something in the past, so, and I'm gonna make a reservation. That's it, really easy. Remember before we, oops, before we used to have to go to the Google Drive, type ourselves, and that was just such a different thing to do. Right now, it's, it's simply a form, you send it over, and then if you guys go to your dashboard, I can see my reservations right here. So it says Majo Flores Conference Room. And, if you want a, a more detailed ver uh, of the day, I can see exactly what um, what is happening on the office right now. So, so which one do you click again? Which one do you click? So here in, we're gonna go to RG Future Center, Office Assets, Reserves Conference Room, and click oh, Reserve. Oh, uh, okay. You go to Offices. Um, do you go here. to office? Office assets here in the top. Uh huh. And then once it comes here, you guys gonna go to reserve conference room. You can see it here on the side or it's in a drop down here. And you're gonna click reserve. Okay. So you the see first this? time, the first time you come into the platform is gonna ask you for your login. Uh, mm -hmm. It's your email, the same one that you've been using with uh, Realty One. And for the first time, your password is gonna be one, two, three, one, two, three. Really difficult to remember. So one, two, I'm three, one, sign in. Two. Yeah, so it's gonna be the email that you have registered with us and one, two, three, one, two, three. I'll be sending everyone a reminder of your email so you guys don't have to worry about it. So maho at rogfuture.com is my email. I have a different password because I already signed in before. And you get in. Normally, all right. So once you guys come for the first time, you're not gonna see that. You're gonna see this beautiful first item, um, which is your like your homepage. And if you haven't signed in before to the reserve conference room, here is the reservations. But once you have signed in on your computer, the link is gonna take you right away. And here's where you're gonna come, and this is the form. Really easy to use. If you guys have questions, just let me know. Um, the good thing is like now, your time slot get blocked. 
So if someone tries to, um, if you see it disappear here, so it reserved 9 a.m. to 10 a.m. So I can't select that one anymore. Uh, the problem we had before with the, conf the, the um, spreadsheet on Google Drive is that if I want it, I can just go back and delete someone's name and put mine. So we're not gonna have that issue anymore. That was that is the first big big thing that I really wanted to show you guys, which I think is amazing, and I really like the way now it's gonna be efficient. Now you guys don't have to worry about someone taking your place. This is just a simplified way to do what we were doing before. Alrighty, da -da let's go back. I'm gonna. Um, there's other things that happen that change in our ROG Future Center. Uh, like the video tutorials, you guys are gonna see some of the video tutorials I have before disappear, and but you still can see your sync tutorials in here. So don't worry, everything that we have saved for your sync is still here. Um, now we're gonna dive in into the most important part of our platform, which is making orders. Uh, if you come to marketing orders, you guys know we have four different or five different uh, ways to order things, right? Um, we can order marketing materials like our flyers or postcards. We can order our brochures, gatefolds, all that it comes to your listing. You can find it here is the first option you always get. Um, and then as well, you can see all the information here in the bottom. It's four steps to place your order. It's really easy to use. And I'm going to show you how to get there. So I'm going to log out. And I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use one of you. I'm gonna use Marilu as my guinea pig. So I'm gonna use Marilu's email. So if you guys see, I click, hold on. I come here, I decided to place an order for flyers. I come here, I click on it. It's gonna take me to the login screen. I'm gonna use Mar Marilu's email. The password is one, two, three, one, two, three for the first time. I'm gonna click login. And this is what you guys are gonna see when you guys log in for the first time. This is your home banner. And now I'm gonna click on flyers. And if you guys see, Marilu's information is already updated here. So Marilu, her diary, her phone number, um, her uh, email address, and then the only couple things are missing are the normal ones, right? If you have a specific website that you want us to use, your title, meaning realtor, broker, associate, uh, the listing price, the listing address. We have everything that we have before in that form that you guys used to uh, fill out to get your flyers done. It is the same process. Um, just a quick reminder, because I get this question all the time, the features are, one bed, two bath, or maybe um, the square footage, those are the features. Your highlights are things like close to bar station, um, recently the model kitchen, um, I don't know, really cheap HOA, something like that. Those are your highlights. So remember, we gave you guys examples here, so you guys have it in mind. Um, another good thing that you can do is, for example, I'm gonna choose the first one, right? We have all the, um, designs the same designs that you guys know before are here on the side you just have to choose the one that you like and imagine you already fill out all your order form with all the information for your property you can come here and select the color so you can have it in black or we have the same flyer in the gold version which you guys already know that um, select the size well it's only one size because they're flyers and the quantity we already know this. I have I want 50 flyers for 60 and 100 for 95. Any additional ideas you guys have? Um, can you add my logo? Um, will you be able to add a QR code for me? This is the link. Blah blah blah. All of those extra information you guys wanna want us to include in your design, please type it down here. And here also. If some of you get sometimes a link to download your images because they're really heavy and they're high, high quality print, which is the ones that we need, remember that. Um, so you can paste the download link in here, in this comment area. Or if you already have the images in your computer, you can just like drag it 
and drop it here. So I'm gonna show you guys a sample. So I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna just take this screenshot and I'm gonna drag it and drop it. And you see the little thing, and now my image is uploaded. That is one way you can do it. The second way you can do it is select file, go to downloads or whatever you have saved your images and click and open. You're always gonna see that little thing. You see the little roll that is telling you, okay, your file is being uploaded. And once you're done filling out your form, the only thing you have to do is add a new project. So I'm gonna fill it out and you guys are gonna see uh, how it works. So I'm just gonna do a random. Let's see, I wanna sell it for $1 million. Okay, my head banner is gonna be new listing. My features, I'm gonna have three beds, two baths, really come on my house. My square footage is gonna be, I don't know, 1845. And I wanna add that I have two garage for example description um i'm just gonna add something from someone's listing oh come on internet don't do this now i'm just gonna copy this one you guys can copy from your uh, MLS. You can, you always can use the same one, the same that we used to do before. And I'm gonna paste it right here. And then my highlights, I'm gonna say, I have a community pool. Um, close to Safeway and parks. Uh, light and this spacious floor plan. I'm just making this up. I decided to choose the gold, the size, the quantity is 100. Every time you change the pricing, you guys see, I'm sorry, and it, every time you change the quantity, it changes the price. So you guys know how much are you paying for them. And any ideas or details, can you not add my headshot? And then once I have it all set up, I'm, I'm really like obsessive. So I like to make sure everything is complete. You can go back and then add a new project. That's it. So now once you get, um, once we get the request, we're gonna get in touch with you and we're gonna do the same thing that we have always done, send you approved, getting, getting ready to print and, um, making sure your flyer looks the way you are expecting it to be. Let me see one thing. Let me see any chance you can. Okay. Let me see if I can get to interact with you guys on the chat and show you how it's gonna be um, the process to actually get the order and come through completely. Uh, for now, I'm gonna go back. So, okay, I ordered my flyers and I really, um, I'm really waiting for the person to uh, email me back and see all the information that I need. Now I'm gonna go back to, I'm gonna close this one. And I'm gonna show you guys the other options. We also have the postcards, right? So if you guys see all of our forms like before were it the exact same way. So all we kept everything consistent so you guys can only type the information you need and get it done. All right. I hear crazy. Oh, you guys see. Perfect. So here we have a project manager. She is emailing me. You guys see? 
on my here on top of my on my messages. She is telling me, thank you for your request. We'll be working on it. And then if I want to, let me see if I remember. Yeah. Can I click on it? All right. Um, I can talk back to her. Thank you. Um, please send me the proof as soon as possible. I don't know if I'm spelling that right. I can see there is a bar on top of that. So you guys see it's a live interaction with our um, designers and all the team is gonna be ready for you guys. So we're gonna get this really interactive. See, she's texting me back. And I'm getting, I don't know if you guys can hear it, but I'm getting a, a little like cling uh, sound when so, uh, someone sends me a message. So this is really easy. Um, maybe, uh, maybe in a couple minutes she can send me something like the proof, so I can show you guys how that one is looking. In the in the meantime, I'm gonna go back to products. I'm gonna go back to uh, the postcards, and I'm gonna show you guys something. So for our postcards, we have different things, and we have always have it. So imagine I'm gonna select the black ones. And we have the three sizes because some of you like the little ones, which is the normal postcard size, but we also have the large ones that are more like this size. This is this one is one of the most common for sending um, to homes, like to mailing app. And then we also have the jumbo ones or extra large, which are the ones that are really, really long. Um, you guys can choose all of that. All the measurements are here attached, if you guys see. So you know what you what you will get out of your postcards. And as well, if I select, for example, the small ones and I select 50, I can see how much this will cost. There is a template. Yeah. So I um there is I'm gonna show you custom designs in a little, but we have the four basic templates that we have before. You guys can see them here. And the only thing you have to do is click on the one that you like. And then you see that little blue button? over here that means that is the one that you're selecting so your de your designer is going to be able to see the one that you select and build your postcard into that one i want you uh, i want you guys to see um that there is some important thing that you guys should know about postcards if we want to mail this out meaning the stamps are gonna go in, the addresses are gonna be at, uh, put on the white space, all the requirements that the post office is gonna ask us about it, we should always request a custom design. Why? Because there's a specific things we have to adjust and move to make them fit for the uh, mailing purposes. Either you guys can select a custom design for mailing and let us do it for you completely, or I have done it before, you guys ask me, just leave it blank. I'll make sure I have all the address and I put the stamps on. That is something else I can do. So if you guys need those ones, always remember for mailing, custom design. And don't worry, I have the little message here. So when you guys come to the, um, the form, you're gonna see, please select custom design for mailing. I close my door. I think I'm being too loud. Um, Alrighty, so now, th now that you guys see this one, I'm gonna show you my other options. We also have the brochures. Uh, I should be showing you guys how do they look. Sorry, we didn't think about it before. Now we also have the brochures. See, you guys remember these ones? They opening, they're opening half, they're four front, back, and the inside, the old printer, um, these are the brochures that are a little bit more expensive, I know, than the, our regular flyers, but they're all really good quality. So when we have those high-end properties, these are the ones that we want to use. And ta -dun, ta -dun, as you guys saw before, we have the four templates in the side. You guys can choose the one you like. As well, we also have the custom design option, which I'm going to talk about it in a second. And we have our form. All our forms are really consistent. We always ask you the same information because we know that's what we need for make your flyer look pretty and to have all the info you 
you guys have to show to your clients. As well, here in the bottom, you're gonna see the color. You can select black or gold. You guys are gonna see something that is, uh, we have it alternated the colors, but that doesn't mean we don't, we don't have it in the other option. So even if I choose the option number one, I can select to have the gold version out of it. But just for the temp, just for the form, you don't, you guys not gonna see the 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 image change. So don't worry about it. Um, the size is just for sure, and the quantity we can see, fifty or a hundred. Same as before, the price uploads uh, like updates by himself depending on how many you want, and um, any ideas or extra details is what we discussed before. Please add my logo. Can you remove my headshot? things like that. Um, if by any reason you guys want something more custom made, like I've been thinking and I got this uh, uh, brochure of this flyer or postcard from someone and I really like this design, would you be able to create it for me? Yes. The only thing you have to do is select your custom design, right? And then if you want us to print them, it will upload the pricing for you as well. Or you can get uh, the design print, the, I'm sorry, the, just the PDF for you to take care of the printing when you select custom design. All right, so that works for all of our options. Uh, it works for our, uh, our postcards, it works for our uh, gate folds, it works for flyers, everything has a custom design option because some of you I know like, oh, well maybe I will get my own design and I'll brand myself that way. Let me show you guys the gate folds. As before, you guys see how we kept that everything is consistent. Let me see, I will show you guys. I get this question really often. What is the difference between the gate fold and the brochure? And this is the difference. So you guys see this one opens up like a book. So every single side of your gateful is synced to show something. This one is our, like our most expensive option, but when you have the property that is a million eight, a million five, those are worth for these guys. Because people is not just gonna take your brochure, I'm um, sorry, your gateful and walk away. They're gonna think, okay, once I'm gonna sell my property in the same neighborhood, this is the person I want my flyers to be with. This is the realtor that's gonna make my dream happen. And as before, works exactly the same way. You can select the colors. The, the only option you have for the size is gay fold, and you can select the queries. So I want to show you guys this here before I touch anything else. If you select just custom design, the pricing starts at $40. It depends on how complex you guys wanna go on your design. So the designers are gonna assess your uh, requirements and then we'll discuss the final pricing with you. But it always starts at $40. If you want us to print, this is uh, the minimum pricing. So I can show you guys how it works uh, for the custom design uh, in a specific class for custom design. But today we're gonna go through almost everything. And for example, I can choose the, the, the different templates and then you guys see our price change. So from the custom design to the templates that we use, there is a drop in price. Same as before, you drag and drop your images or you, or you copy your link in here, um, headshot, your logos, everything that you guys wanna attach and make sure it is included on your, um, flyer or your product or whatever it is, just make sure you have it here and then add a new project. So all our forms are working exactly the same. Let me, da -da -da -da. Um, I'm really excited to show you guys this one. So you guys know we have some promos. So now we have a little store. So I know you guys sometimes are like, hey Maho, can you put together a little giveaway back for my clients so maybe they can, be able to um, um, I'm sorry. It, um, it has to be. Uh, blah, blah, blah. I got. I love my strength. Sometimes you want to just get a little bag for your clients, put it together like a present, and leave it in the countertop. So when they're moving in, 
All of these giveaway is products are in our office. You guys can get it through us and we can put together a little um, present for them. So you guys can walk around here and see all the different things that we have in the office for you. Ordering is really easy. It works just like when you work in any other, like Macy's or Nonstrom's. You're gonna select the person, the thing you like. You're gonna click Add to Cart. You can add more items, so continue shopping or proceed to check out. Once you proceed to check out, as you see, all your data is being pulled by your, for the platform for you, so you don't have to worry about that. And then. Oh, um, for picking up, make sure you do San Ramon because right now I'm the only one who is actually giving them away. And you guys know um, there is no one in the office in um, Castro Valley, so no one can actually get it there. And then we have, we have on hold the list for our Oakland office. So make sure you select San Ramon and comments, maybe please back for prison or something like that. Once you have it done, uh, we're gonna do place order. Alrighty, and then you will get, your order has been received. What is the status of your order? And then I'm gonna get a notification that says, oh, Marilu wants a tote bag. So I'm gonna have it ready for her. And in the front desk, she can come and pick it up. I know some of you have asking, well, what is gonna happen if I, how I'm gonna pay? Because I made my order and there is no way to put my credit card. We're gonna keep it the same way we've been doing it. We will invoice you through your Zone account. So you guys don't have to worry about putting your credit card in a new page for now. We'll take care of all your orders and we'll, we'll charge you through our system. So you don't have to worry about that. Uh, let's go back to our homepage. All right, let's see. Okay, so I'm being told that our flyer is ready to take a look at it. So the way we're gonna do is we're gonna, remember this is just a sample, so it doesn't have any info. And we're gonna go to dashboard. Dun, dun. We can see here who is working on my um, flyer, right? The budget, the deadline, and the status completed. So now we're gonna do the thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna go to projects. Here, you see it, and then it's completed, so I'm gonna do download. Okay, we're gonna wait for my internet, which is really slow lately, to download. And we have our flyers. So this is generic, don't worry. But it doesn't have Mary Lou's info. It's because this is just a sample. Um, and that's it. So if you order for just for, you're gonna take care of the printing, you're gonna get your download that is ready. And if you, uh, if we're taking care of the printing, we will let you, we'll contact you when your order is ready to pick up. So don't worry about that. Um, already, let's go back to our store. There's another two, there's three more things I wanna show you guys. Well, there's like 10 things actually, I'm lying. But um, I re remember this one. If you guys want new signs, you can just click here and it takes you directly to these signs. So you guys don't have to worry about, um, how do I get to these signs? What I don't see our designs is because we have our specific domain with them. So this is the, either you can click in this icon or if you go back to our RG future, we have it in signs and more. It works exactly the same. So there's always options for you to go and check and get your signs done. Now uh, we're going. I'm going to show you guys the presentations. The presentations are those things that you guys order really often: are the listing presentation, the buyers and sellers booklets, the trifles. All that info is in here. So if you're like, "But I can't find my trifles. How do I'm going to get that done?" Just come to the presentations area, and you guys are going to see it here. You see the samples. Or, uh, right. So in this one, you guys are gonna notice, I tried to click on the listing presentation, but it doesn't go because we have different options. Remember, we have one that is in a nice leather binder, which I don't have it here. 
Oh, I do. Hold on. Right? We have one that it comes in this nice leather binder. It has all the tabs inside. That is option number one. So if you come to select product, you go to listing presentation, and then it, uh, it gives you the option for the letter binder, which is this guy. Right? I'm going to click that one. And then it's going to show me the price. This is the total with your listing presentation. Everything is going to come in here. Uh, the other option that we have is as well, we can get your listing presentation done. Uh, we can get it bound, but I don't have a sample of that one, which is like the booklets, the, the buyers and seller booklets that you guys know. As well, you can just choose and it will show you how much it costs for that one. Um, for your buyers and sellers. So here's when we divide it. So if you click buyers, you can select the booklets, which are the books, right? Or you can select the trifolds. And the, remember, they all come in packages. So if I come to the quantities, I can select 6, 10, or 20. Right? So um, it works exactly the same as before, but instead of having, I have like seven different uh, um, Google forms for you guys to follow when you need it at the uh, listing presentation or a bound, or a bound um, buyer package. Now we have it all in the same, everything is consistent. Same like before, you just fill out your form, right in the top you already see all Marilu's information is coming through. The only things missing is her website, title, and bio and client testimonials. Remember, we do customize your um, buyers and sellers as well as your listing presentation. So you just have to paste the paragraphs of your bio and some of your client testimonials in here and send them to us. Remember, your trifles don't come with bio. They're so, they're not, there's not enough space. So this is your trifle, but it doesn't come with bio. Any additional comments you guys, I know you guys know all of this, but uh, some of you are like, can I have my info in the, in the front? I guess you can just ask for it, it's fine. And anything that you guys wanna add, drag and drop all your, hey, can you actually, I don't wanna use my normal uh, headshot, I wanna use this one because, I don't know, it's brand new, so I'm just gonna put it in here. Or I wanna add my logo, or I got this new certification logo that I wanna add into my uh, marketing materials, drag and drop, or select the file and search for it. Really easy to use. I'm gonna stop one second, if anyone has any questions. I see little heads just telling. Everything is being clear, I'm going too fast. I know I speak really fast. No, I guess not. I'm gonna continue. Okay. And then I'm gonna show you this one that you guys are also familiar with, which is business cards. As well for our business cards, you guys are I'm familiar with all our designs. You see them here, and then you guys remember there is all the colors. So you can choose the one that you like. And we what we added uh, lately uh, is some of them now I have vertical options because some people were like, well, I love the vertical, but I don't like the specific design that you guys have for the vertical. So I added extra vertical options. You guys can see them all here, right? Um, same thing. When he asks you for address, make sure you guys add the address that you want to display so if you want the San Ramon address, make sure you say it here or the Castro Valley address. I have some uh, agents that are like, well, I have my own office address, which is the one I wanna use for my business cards. Make sure you add it here. If you add your home address, that is gonna be printed. So make sure you don't put your home address if you don't want your home address to be in your business cards. When it comes to select type, it comes premium, I'm sorry, standard, premium, Lux Bevel, Go For, and Spark Gloss. These are the ones that you guys know by memory. The standard ones are the cheapest ones that we have. You guys know, nothing really stands out of them. The premium has a nice coating that is like softy, like more almost like silk. That one is the premium one. 
the Lux Velvet is literally like velvet. Imagine them, if you guys remember Amanda's business cards, that is the feeling of that one. And then gold foil is one of my most popular ones, I have to say. And then the gold foil is this one. Let me see. I just printed one here. I don't know if you guys can see it. You see? So this is the gold foil. And in, if you guys are not like, oh, okay, that's too much gold. I want, you guys can also have a race, which is transparent and that is called spot gloss. So these are the fancy options that we have as well. I wait, I don't can't find my camera. So you guys see how it is raised and this one is in gold ink. Uh, same thing, anything that you guys wanna add to your design, hey, can I have round corners? Or can you add this logo as well? All that information, please add it here. Um, the quantities, you can, oh, well, that's the next one. Quantities are, keeps the same as we had before. The standard are, um, that we had is 250 or 500. And if you select, it will change the pricing out of it. Please make sure when you guys adding for your business cards, your headshot, remember we need a high quality print headshot. Some people is like, oh, but business cards is a little. Why would they need a big quality print? Because this, the material they're printed in, they need to be really, really high quality. So when you guys send me uh, images that you put it on, take on your phone, like selfies, it's really hard to, hard to get them printed right. So let's make sure we get um, high quality print headshots. If you don't have a headshot, you guys can always email me. We can take it here at the office. You guys know that. All right. Let's go back. So I have shown you guys all our products, right? Business cards, flyers, postcards, brochures, gatefolds, all that is you, the things you already know. The presentations is the ones that you already use for your clients. And we added our promo store. That is where, you, where you're gonna select all the giveaways that we have in the office to create something, or maybe just for yourself. Maybe you lost your one pin and you want to re, uh, replace it. You can purchase it here. Now we have another, or little things here in the top that's office assets custom design social media and reservations so when i come to office assets i know you guys have this struggle all the time here are our logos don't worry you can download them here or you can also download them from the office assets in the our rog future center here is our logo kit. So we have you guys covered. We have it in our platform. We have it in our website. So every, I know some of you are like, oh, I can find the logo. Well, don't worry. There's no stress. They're all here. All right. We also have our welcome package. So for the ones who are like, oh, I came to my orientation, but I forgot. I, I lost my booklet and I still need it. Here is where you can download it. And then we can also have the buyer questionnaire the house, house, uh, house hunting checklist. You guys can just print these ones for your clients, have it handy when you're gonna see a house, or the open house comparison chart, right? House number one, and now number two, and you can, it's an easy way and it's a good resource for you guys to remember all the houses you guys see. And the last thing we have in here is called social media do's and don'ts. This one is one that we created, um, is our most recent one, where you can find all the different ways to process things on your social media. Why should I be posting in Facebook? Why should I be posting in uh, Instagram? Uh, what is LinkedIn for? All of that information is in this little booklet. Let me go back to, how do I go back? Yeah. All right, now we have our custom design um, tab. We'll be clicking here. So you see how it says, get a quote, get a quote, get a quote. So this one is when you guys come with a full design, like, okay, okay, I know what I want. You can either order it through the normal form or you can come straight here and order your custom design. And you can get everything out of here. Other things that we added is here in the bottom, we have social media, branding, websites, and print requests. So we are able to create a social media program for you guys. That's something that we didn't have before. Now we have the um, 
the ability to do it for you so we can get a quote from this one we also can create some branding if you want like to get a full focus on okay so how marilu wants to be seen through her marketing uh we can uh customize the websites create websites for you guys or we can do the normal print request sometimes i know the photographers include the flyers right but they don't include the printing so you can send us those uh PDFs that the photographer send you and we can print it for you. So here is a request uh, form here. Mm -hmm. Let me go back. Now, if I'm gonna click in social media. So here is like a fast link to go to your social media request where everything is discussing here. Alrighty, so once you if you guys are some of you have asked me before hey how can you manage my social media i can i don't have enough hands i wish but now we have the willpower so we're gonna have, have it ready for you and ta -dun, ta -dun, and then the one that you already know which is reservations this is it we have been working so hard there is i know it's a lot of things happening some of them are things that you know but then just in different ways to see it right like it used to be everything to Google Forms. Now we have it all in one single platform. Now we can chat with you directly. Now we can have everything done in a proper way. So I wanna hear you guys' comments, suggestions, ideas, um, anything you guys wanna share with us. <laughs> 